What's up guys? I know it's been a long ass time since I made a video. About a month or so, I don't know exactly. Anyway, today I'm showcasing Cliffhanger. This was the map, the next map I made, I think it was like the fifth map I made in Forge. It's, made, it's meant for 2v2, 3v3, 4v4, anything really. 1v1 will work too. It's a little bit disorienting, it's kind of a small map, but it's, desi it's designed for Slayer Capture Flag. It's fun though. Um, no, not really much OP Slayer. weapons. We'll I guess see we'll what see you in can a do. Anyway, there's mainly these two. It's mainly these two spires you can see right here. Um, and yeah, so each team spawns with one energy sword. That's the only power weapon on each side. No snipers, nothing like that. So uh, you have to go over to our team's base or a spire to really attack them. And yeah. Spires use a lot more objects than they look like they do, believe it or not. They almost use the whole object limit actually as map is. And fucking lag anyway. Yeah. So over here you won't die if you just go a little bit off this map, but if you fall down there, you of course die. And did put a couple kill boundaries for, like, yeah. So pretty much once you go off this edge, you die. And the same goes over there. Map doesn't favor either team. You can use a gravity launcher, get up to the top level. name was, I think, Sharon TL34 or something. I don't remember the name anyway. But yeah, it kind of has a similar feel to that, I found. Yeah, small map, so this video shouldn't be too long. It pretty much about sums it up. There's a teleporter on the bottom and a teleporter on the top on each side. And yeah. Let's see. Show. Get a good view from above. Yeah, so this about sums up the map, just these two spires. And each side has the teleporter on the bomb, teleporter on the top, and a gravity launcher to get between levels. And yeah, the flags are in the middle level in Capture Flag. Yeah, it's perfect for 2v2. Um, but also works for 3v3 or 4v4 or 1v1. Really, yeah, it, just, it won't go above 4v4. That's the highest number of players will work for. But anyway, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe, and I'll leave a Forge Hub and Halo Waypoint link for it's in the description. Alright, see you next time.